Hi friends, welcome back to Cadable. This is Engineer Brian Umar and today I'll be showing you how to make a sheet metal bracket in Solid Edge. Uh, I'm using Solid Edge V20 and uh, I'll be covering commands like uh, uh, contour flange, unbend, uh, uh, normal cutout, hold, rebend, etc. So let's go to your file and click new and click this normal part sheet metal and click OK. And now we are in Solid Edge interface. So let's go to sketch and let's select this front plane and uh, line tool is already selected so we'll be making some lines here to here one line here uh, one line here and one line here okay that's fine uh, now we'll be constructing uh, our geometry let's go to here connect and select this line and uh, i'll be constructing this line with this uh, plane right uh, uh, as you can see that also uh, these flanges uh, will be equal in length so let's go to here equal relation and okay that's fine and now uh, we'll be giving some uh, suitable dimensions so let's dimension it uh, 25 okay and let's dimension uh, sorry uh, go to smart dimension tool again and let's change it to 30 uh, that's fine and uh, the length will be let's say 35 or let's change it to 30 okay that's fine return and finish now it will again ask you to uh, draw some sketch so just cancel this and now uh, uh, i'll be using this command contour flange i cannot use a tab command because tab commands require a close contour so let's go to here uh, contour flange and i'll be using this select from sketch because i have already drawn uh, sketch right uh, select this and uh, now it is asking the uh, thickness so i think one millimeter thickness is fine uh, click downwards and uh, uh, just select this symmetric and let's change this to let's say uh, 30 or uh, i think 30 let's change it to 40 okay that's fine click finish uh, you can set your uh, parameters let's say i'll change this bend radius to 1.5 okay that's fine I just cancel this and uh, now uh, we'll uh, unbend this so let's go to here unbend and uh, select this and click uh, here all bends and click here okay uh, preview finish uh, now uh, uh, we'll be making some uh, cutouts here and here and then uh, some holes uh, just cancel this and uh, let's go to sketch select this and now uh, so click here circle uh, circle by center I uh, will make a circle here okay that's fine and now uh, 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 this circle will be tangent to this line this line and this line so let's go to tangent select circle select line and select circle again select line select circle again and select line okay that's fine and uh, let's make a line And uh, let's uh, trim this and I think uh, let's trim this uh, as well okay that's fine and uh, uh, let's make a whole uh, uh, okay uh, that's fine so let's go to mirror and uh, okay mirror tool select this and select this one okay uh, so we are done uh, click finish and uh, uh, it is again asking uh, you to uh, uh, draw some sketch so let's cancel this and uh, now we'll go to uh, here uh, normal cutout and uh, select this one and click ok downwards and uh, as you can see uh, we are done with this cutout right so let's make uh, another one uh, uh, we can mirror as well but uh, let's go to a normal cutout again click here okay and downwards finish so uh, let's make some holes uh, let's go to your hole and uh, let's like this and we'll be making a hole here and a hole let's say a hole here okay return and uh, downwards and click finish uh, it is again asking so let's cancel this and now we'll be 
uh, rebanding, right? Unbend and rebend. So let's go to here rebend and uh, let's select. Uh, let's go to here all bands. Click all bands. Okay. Preview and finish. Uh, now you can hide these sketches. Uh, let's go to here hide and you can hide your uh, uh, basic profile, right? Let's go to sorry. Let's go to here sketch and you can hide it from here uh, from the design tree, right? Uh, we can hide uh, our, uh, our planes as well. Let's go to here and uh, hold shift key and uh, right click and hide. And now uh, we are done with this uh, basic uh, uh, sheet metal uh, bracket in solid edge and uh, uh, just close this and uh, we'll go to here view uh, sorry uh, we'll go to here the uh, format part painter and now we can apply some uh, material or some texture to this so let's go to some uh, let's say metal and uh, Let's go to uh, let's say uh, aluminium and uh, all body click here and now you can see the uh, preview right uh, uh, we can apply this material to uh, let's say let's go to again here brass and let's select face and uh, uh, as you can see that uh, we can apply a material to some face feature or uh, body or uh, all features of the same body let's say if it is consisted of uh, assembly so we can uh, click this all features of the same uh, type right uh, so uh, let's close this so we are done with this uh, uh, sheet metal bracket and uh, i hope you like it and if you have any questions regarding this tutorial or any other uh, in my list you can ask in comment section thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more informative and interesting projects thank you